right. It is, I think it's week, I think it's the last couple days of week seven, I believe. That's what it is. So this would be week seven day, what is today, Saturday? Yeah, week seven day six. Um, today, we've got a swim followed up with Yeah, today we're going to start out the day with the swim, and we're going to follow it up with a push day. Which is kind of a lot, all like back to back. But <coughs> swimming, I feel like swimming is more of a pulling movement, especially like swimming freestyle. It's more of a really kind of a back and shoulder focused movement, almost. It is Saturday, so I think the gym closes at 5, I believe. <coughs> And this is this is like the main reason to have a Y membership is just so I have a place to swim, especially in the summer, in the winter when it's cold as fuck outside. Can't really do any outdoor swims. I mean, you could, but it just sucks so bad, you know. So this is like the main reason I got a Y membership, especially when I was training for that Ironman. But now I really haven't been training for the Ironman very often. I've been running like three miles just about every other day, ish. You know what I mean, on and off. Um, but there really hasn't been any cardio training beyond that. So. I've signed up for an Olympic length triathlon. I haven't signed up for it, but I've agreed to it with my sister. So that basically means I'm doing it, which means I'm going to have to get back in the pool and start swimming again. Ugh, dude, that also means I'm going to have to start biking again. God damn it, I hate that bike so much. I hate that bike so much. <laughs> but also an Olympic length bike is only like, God damn it, things broke bad today. An Olympic length bike is only like, what, 25, 26, 27 miles, something like that. That's really not that bad. I mean, that's, you know, an hour and a half on the bike. It's really not that bad, you know? So I need to start doing that again. I need to get back to doing cardio consistently. And when I'm in Greenville, I need to get back to doing two-a-days consistently, which today is not really, I mean, it's not really a two-a-day. It's, it's. You know, usually a two-a-day is a workout in the morning then a workout in the afternoon, but today we're just getting two workouts in back-to-back, -back, so I guess I guess it kind of constitutes as a two-a-day. God damn, dude, this fucking thing. This fucking thing. I hate it. Yeah, so it's not like technically a two-a-day, but it's close enough. You know what I mean? It is two workouts today, just back-to-back -to -back, rather than one in the morning and one in the afternoon. But when I'm in town, I have the ability to go in the morning and then go at like lunch or after work or something like that. You know what I mean? It's, it's much easier than when I'm on the road, which I am on the road like every other week nowadays, but still, while I'm here, I need to start getting two days in, get a run, bike, swim, something like that done in the morning, and then hit the gym in the afternoon. Maybe vice versa. Just because I'd really rather lift first, because then... Like, whichever one you do first in the day is going to affect the second one, right? Like, if I run first, it's going to affect my lift later that day. I'm not going to have quite as much energy, be a little bit more fatigued starting out, everything else. And I'd rather have a fresh lift than, you know, I'd rather have, like, a really good lift that affects my run a little bit than a really good run that then affects my lift and I'm not much moving as much weight. So, probably lift in the morning. Maybe that'll be the new plan. Yeah, it's probably the move. Um, dude, I don't know if I've talked about this yet, but when we went skiing last weekend, fucked, bro. I, <laughs> I ate it so fucking heavy. Oh my god, I'll throw that video on there. Oh! I fucking ate it. Just absolutely ate it. And it was one of those things where, you know, I really felt good about it too. Like, like I dropped that cliff and I was like, oh, I fucking got this. And then as soon as I landed, I was like, I don't have this at all. This is going to hurt. And it did. But I had enough shots of fireball that day to where it wasn't that bad. You know what I mean? Until like the next morning. And the next morning I felt every bit of it. But skiing is a fucking workout and I love it. I love being able to go ski. That was a long ass day. We drove up there in the morning, skied all day, and then drove back that night. So it was a long ass day. But I love skiing because it's like, it's a good ass workout, but it doesn't even feel like it. You know what I mean? Like, because you're enjoying yourself so much all day long, you get tired and everything else, and it's such a good workout, but 
it's like not a chore like like most of the time when you go to the gym or go swim it's such a good such a good cardio day my favorite cardio day is skiing damn it this fucking guy but um yeah the song for the today is gonna be midnight city by m83 i've tried to play this one like twice before but every time i try and play this song it's like I ended up not videoing in the gym or the videos I took were trash and I ended up not making the video, whatever. So this is like the third time I'm actually saying this song in the car, but this time we're actually gonna make it happen. I believe this time. All right, let's go ahead and get it done. Starting off with a swim, then moving on to, it'll probably be more of a chest biased push day, chest and tri biased push day. Just because after swimming, my shoulders will already be fatigued. So I'll get a few shoulder move movements in there, but be more focused on chest and, chest and tries today. All right, we'll, we'll, let's go get it done. We'll see you in there. shit dude talk about a gym sesh that took way too long for basically no reason i mean the pool in there ended up being closed unfortunately which you know i walked in i was like fine you know whatever and i have more time to hit chest and and shoulders and tries whatever so I, you know not overly mad about it i mean we're chilling no big deal I'll go get a swim in tomorrow um and I made sure to ask about the pool hour so I actually know when the pool's open tomorrow because their website is wrong. But man, I mean, there wasn't that many people in there, right? There wasn't that many people. It just seemed like every machine that I wanted to use, there was someone using it, right? So there was a lot of working in with other people, which again is fine. Like, you know, I didn't video a few sets just because I was working in with somebody and you know what I mean? I don't want to be that guy that's like, yo, like, let me set up my camera while I'm working in with you. You know what I mean? So. I, I didn't video my front raises. I didn't video bench because I was working with someone on bench. But man, it just took forever in there. It was brutally long, a brutally long lift. And then today was one of those days I didn't feel like talking very much. You know what I mean? Like a lot of days I go to the gym. It's like people want to chat. It's like, fuck yeah, dude. Like, let's, you know what I mean? I'm happy to have a conversation, whatever. Today was one of those days I just wanted to go in and just lift and listen to my music and not talk to anybody. And God, it just seems like people would not stop talking to me today. You know what I mean? And I was sitting there thinking in my head, like, please, God, just let me, just let me get my set in. Like, I'm so done with this conversation. Like, please just let me get my set in. But I don't want to be a dick. You know what I mean? But it's like, God, and this guy was just talking forever and ever. And I was just sitting there thinking, like, I just really just want to get my last set in. Like, that's all I want to do right now. I want to get my last set in. I want to listen to my music and I want to go on to my next movement. But, man. 
was one of those things. I feel bad bitching about it because it was actually a super nice guy, actually. You know what I mean? He was actually a great dude, whatever, whatever. But, uh, man, just a frustrating, frustrating gym session all around. You know what I mean? Just between the time it took, having to work in with people, the pool being closed, just overall frustrated with, with that lift. But, you know, can't win all of them. Not every single one's going to be a fun lift. So, you know, it's going to happen every now and again. Well, regardless of it being a frustrating gym session. Oh, shit. We are better today than we were yesterday. And we'll be better tomorrow than we are today. Good shit, team.